This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN, headline news yeah, update. Good morning, everyone. On this Friday, the very first day of September, we're looking at a very interesting 10 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. Yep, the unemployment rate was a bit lower. The market initially loved it, and then it gave it back. I'm going to talk about that in my show about these particular Chapman Wave techniques that really worked very well earlier on. So let's see what happens after this. Why? Because the Dow right now is still up 156 at 34,878. It had some really... There's some good things going on in the Dow when you look at it overall. Yes, UNH was just tanked yesterday, but uh, Salesforce ran up very strongly. Look at the S&P. The S&P at this particular point gave back a chunk. Uh, red candle so far, but it's still up 931 at 45.17. This is pretty good. And the stochastic has gone over 80, 85%. Looking at the QQQ, it had a fabulous early morning move and then it came back a lot. Now it's just unchanged at 377 point, uh, yeah, 378, let's call it. You're looking at the IWM. The IWM is trading right now. It's a Russell small, a small caps pulling back uh, 190 at 34. It's down uh, up $1.74, but off the high. Uh, I don't think it's all done yet in terms of the, the overall market. So gold had a really good rally early on with that news, spiked up sharply. It's now up, uh, it's unchanged. At 1965, I want to talk about this as well. I told you that this 200 period moving average, in my experience, says that it becomes a magnet level. We'll see if that holds the market because the dollar right now is actually holding fairly well. It's down 27 ticks at 103.37. If you consider what's going on, uh, yes, it looks like it's turning down, but it hasn't yet fully. And we're looking at the bonds. U.S. bonds are trading oh, sharply lower. So yields are going higher, up almost a dollar, uh, up a, one and a half points in 120 and 1030 seconds. Wow, these things move so quickly. And look at crude oil. Crude oil is huge, just broken out to a new recovery high, leg D in the weekly chart. Oh, these things I have to talk about when I get back for my show, the Tiger Technicians Hour. And have a ch check out my opening call, my daily newsletter. It's been, wow, we've had some real, uh, real interesting positions there. So I'll be back in a moment. And uh, the Dow is up 184. We'll be back and we'll talk about all these different aspects as soon as I return. <laughs> 